Hi, my name is Miguel from AvoidErrors.net. In this tutorial, I'm going to be showing you guys how to set up a mirrored array in Windows 8.1. For this, you would need two partitions equal in size or two hard drive equal in size. Now, there's two ways of doing this, mirroring an existing drive or starting from scratch. So let's start with the first one. I have added two hard drive and one of them is already being used. I'm going to access them by right clicking computer manage disk management notice here I have two hard drive one already formatted and being used and one unallocated which is a brand new if I right click disk one here open I have dummy content pretending that is actual content so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna mirror disk one to disk two and from there on everything I write on my disk one is automatically copied on my second disk so just right click disk one add mirror select disk two which is the only available one to mirror add mirror this pop-up means it's gonna convert your disk to dynamic disk click yes and now depending on how big or how much information you have it'll take to resync both drives once it's done healthy you can right click on the second disk open and it will have the same information as the first now the second option would be as if you bought two drive equal in size and you want to mirror them here in this example I have two unallocated drive which are two brand new installed drives now you can right click either drive and select new mirrored volume next to the wizard now add the uh, second uh, drive once selected click next you can change the drive letter if you like next and change the volume label and also perform a quick format if you want a quick format next and finish the wizard now this would be much faster since there is no information on the drive remember click yes to change your uh, drive to dynamic disk once it's healthy you have created a mirrored array remember this is a redundant system not a backup okay Thank you for watching this video. My name is Miguel. If you have any questions, feel free to post them in the comment section below. Thank you.